we're all addicted to our devices. Like, we gotta start learning how to unplug, get off the grid, except for short order cooks. They just have to get off the grid all. <laughs> For years, the fishing industry has tried to up the marketability of trash fish Yummy. by giving them more appealing, uh, sexier names. Dolphin head is now Mahi Mahi. Slime head is now Orange Ruffy. Spiny dog, dogfish is now Rock Salmon. Patagonian toothfish is now Chilean Sea Bass. <laughs> Yeah, I know all about this because I have a friend named Karen and like she taught everyone to call her Karen and now everybody calls her Karen and like people suddenly respect her. I was like, wait, have you ever seen a Patagonian toothfish aka a Chilean sea bass? It's like if Gollum and T-Rex gave birth to a windsock with Benjamin Button disease. Talk about getting catfished. I bet Catfish the Fish are really angling to uh, unhook their name from Catfish the Online predators, dupers, and people who are just sat to the core, am I right? <laughs> I only use flashlights that can be deep fried. The atomic beam is one of the most powerful flashlights on Earth. Like, who are the people who use flashlights that can't be deep fried? <gasps> Wait, why am I wearing a kimono? I grew up in upstate New York, but now I live in Los Angeles, and there are many differences between the two. For example, in upstate New York, it's all about, like, interstates and highways, but here in LA, it's all about the freeway. Like, it's so free despite the fact that you're sitting in 20 minutes of bumper to bumper every other 20 minutes. <sighs> but the biggest difference between the two places, in upstate New York, if you have cars and junk all over your yard, people think it's white trash. In Southern California, it's somehow really romantic and cool, and it's just like, oh, no, 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 that's not garbage. It's just they live on a ranch. That rusty truck and the rusty giant wheel with the rusty water pump, rusty giant shoe. You just have cool, rusty stuff. Ranch living. White trash ranch, ranch, white trash. Are they the same? Are they different? Does this conversation even matter? No, it doesn't. Is it dumb? Certainly. Is white trash like a pretty like un PC term? Yeah, it is. Do some people take offense to it? Sure, they do. Am I using it still? Of course I am. Is it right? No, it's not. And I will stop using it. But I mean, there could be white trash that's not white. You know what I'm saying? Like whammy trash. But I am proud to wear my whammy trash. I put it on and I love it. I have a confession. I think that ranch dressing tastes like trash, like creamy trash that happens to be the color white. I am H-O. Okay. You guys, thank you so much for entering. Hashtag whammy grandpa. Um, Mr. Trevor Rose, thank you so much for telling me about your sore joints. On Twitter, at Visagetarian said that they make best grandpa because they like to fish and a lot of their shirts are plaid. That might also make you lumberjack or just somebody who likes plaid shirts. At Daniel Snatling said they make best grandpa because they have cookies. Are they in the oven or on your computer? Computer. The winner this week will receive this custom native gold whammy bop pin. DM me with your dresses because I'm not just going to throw it to you across the United States. Actually, you guys, I didn't just choose one winner. I chose two. Hecapoo Garnet and Alexander Jambleton. I'm walking a sausage. I'm walking. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much for entering. Thank you so much for watching. You know, I got to say with these giveaways, I know they're so dumb, but... You know it's not dumb that you guys are entering, that you guys are having fun, that you guys are being creative, and selfishly that you're making me laugh. That is like the best part of it all. I love you guys. Like, as if you were my own grandchildren. Like, hop aboard this knee! Oh, don't actually. That's so creepy. And don't do that to anybody. That's like the ultimate creeps. Protect yourself. You guys, very important. Two more days until new Steven Universe episodes. <laughs> Keep following along on my social media. You know I'm gonna have reactions to these new episodes. And if you had fun today, please like, subscribe, share, leave me a comment. I wanna hear from you. Maybe you'll tell me how swim practice was. Maybe you'll tell me what you ate for breakfast. Maybe you won't, and maybe I won't care, or maybe I will. Maybe I'll cry, cause I didn't hear from you. Okay, be safe out there. Love you lots, bye. Nyaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa